use that. from high school. Forgot I attached tracking dots to these. Wonder how many of these are scattered around the city. Ongoing near Union Square. Please copy. Hi, Mr. Lee. Hey, Peter. We're all set for the party whenever you're ready. Cool. I'm on my way. <laughs> Peter, I just want to make sure you haven't left any equipment you've built for your friend around the lab. It's no bother to me, but if the Grand Committee stops by again... Don't worry, Doc. I make a point not... MJ wrote this article in the school paper about student protests. She was a heck of a journalist even then. Some good parts from this old cell phone. Wonder what I could accomplish with a real budget instead of dumpster diving. This article blaming Spider Man for electro killing cops was the last straw. I had to quit taking pictures that helped Jameson print lies about me. My thesis paper on neurotechnology. This got me the job with Dr. Octavius. In progress. Reported location is Murray Hill. Fisk beat the hell out of me with these. I almost used them for evidence, until MJ pointed out I was trespassing, so I'd probably end up in jail. Tip. To 
took a bullet from the cops back when they thought I was working with Electro. Good thing textbooks are thick. Too bad they're also expensive. I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on demon, uh, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? I'm back now. Headed to that shipyard. Any intel on what Fisk uses it for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. His name's Jefferson Davis. That's his beat. He's a good cop. Been working the Fisk case for years. If anyone knows what's going on at that shipyard, it's... Rhino almost killed me until I broke this chip off his horn and figured out what his costume's made of. Assault in progress. Caution advised. Report came in from Clinton. Over. It gets court! Now I realize that's harsh. But so is my tax bill! Harry's VIP card for the nightclub. Harry always tried to include me. these electrician's gloves in my first fight with Electro. Gave me the idea to add insulation to my costume, which saved my bacon more than once. Norman never listens to Harry. Even tried to kill funding for his research stations. Hey, one of those stations is nearby. Should see how they're doing while Harry's in Europe. Must be some way to help Doc. I'll think of something. Hey, my Mark I web shooters. Managed to improve the storage capacity a lot since then, but the basic design's still the same. Traffic control point Charlie taking fire from demons. My ESU ID badge from my semester as a teaching assistant. Didn't have time to stick with it, but I could definitely see teaching again someday. Hey, MJ. All right, I picked up a bunch of stuff at the store. Can't wait to see what you come up with. Swinging over now. Prepare to be amazed. <laughs> My Wilson Fisk Science Prize trophy. And check. I couldn't turn it down without arousing suspicion, but no way was I going to take his money. Even though we could have used it. I did accept the lifetime supply of backpacks, though. To expect an attack at any moment? My opinion, folks, the answer is... Yes. Oh, oh man. I meant to wash this gym shirt six years ago. P.U. Never finished this application for the coffee bean. Would have paid more than what I'm doing now. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter, Aunt May's recipe for wheat cakes. 
I could never make it work on my own. That's Miles' mom. Hello? Mr. Parker? It's Rio Morales. I want to thank you for getting Miles the job at the feast shelter. Glad to. And please, call me Peter. Superheroing doesn't leave much time for good hygiene. Gotta get it where I can. My underarm webs. Thought they might help me glide short distances, but they never really worked. Looked cool, though. The infamous dumpling recipe. Should have come with step 10, try not to burn everything in MJ's apartment. My prom boot in here. Crushed when I had to fight Fisk. That kind of symbolizes my luck with relationships. When the vulture cracked my eye lens, it almost blinded me. That was a wake-up call. Had to upgrade to a stronger material. Kill! Not just you. This is the problem with that masked maniac. The police are able to coordinate efforts, block streets, lay down tire shredding strips. This piece of the Shocker's original uniform showed me how to protect myself from his blasts. Of course, they always upgrade, don't they? I beat this wrestler right after getting my powers. Never had that much money before in my life. Or since, come to think of it. Now reports are coming in that Martin Lee, along with exhibiting freakish abilities like those of you-know-who, has lately seemed to display almost a split personality. <laughs> this is hogwash! Jameson gave me this at his Bugle retirement party. I thought nobody would listen to his talk show. Shows how much I know. Oh yeah, that blind guy gave me his card in case Spider-Man ever needs a lawyer. Wait, hold on. If he's blind... How did he know I was Spider-Man? Gotta have something to do on stakeouts. The good luck card from when I left the Daily Bugle to go into research. Some really great people there. And Jameson. Every day in every way, I'm getting better and better. Why doesn't it ever feel like it? Injured shoulder eventually healed. The bill took a lot longer to pay. I bought this used graphing calculator at a pawn shop. Stopped working in the middle of a trig exam. Huh, you get what you pay for.
All units, just received report of a- Yuri, just calling you back. Your mom doing okay? Fine. Right back to complaining about not having grandchildren. A spider signal. Cool idea, but any light source that made it bright enough was also way too hot. Someday, though. piece of Mysterio's helmet gave me ideas for my eye lenses. Go ahead, sue me, fishbowl head. Wish I knew who made this comic about me. Kid's got a future. Spidey Squad, my one and only fan club. When Jameson's going off on me, it helps to remember they're out there. One of these days I'll work out a fabric that warps sound and light waves. A stealth suit would really come in handy. Rejected costume designs. Not bad, but I think the white spider was definitely the way to go. Supposedly Fisk made his fortune selling these spices. I mean, they're good, but not that good. Still not sure if opening this would set the Sandman free, but I'm in no hurry to find out. Okay, this one confounded me for a while. Apparently Spider-Man's been seen throughout the city tampering with steam regulators. Aside from generally being a vandal and a troublemaker, why would he do this? I'll tell you why. Because when the city has to send crews out to fix these problems, they need police to direct traffic around them. That's officers who aren't stopping cr- Almost forgot I bought this snow globe for Aunt May. I think I get my love for this city from her. This is Sable Control. Need an update on the situation in Hell's Stack. With this vial of the lizard's blood, I was able to mix up a cure and turn him back into Dr. Connors. Too bad it didn't last. After I got my powers, I didn't need my glasses anymore. Told everyone I got laser eye surgery with money from the Fisk Science Prize. Maybe this will help me balance work and a personal life, if I ever find time to read it. People know my parents died in a plane crash, but I still can't tell anyone they were government agents. Wish I knew more about them. Oh, 
All I did was save this kid's balloon from floating away, and he made me this. It's the little things that make it all worth it. <laughs>